welcome back to Mia's Life. Today I'm going to be doing my monthly favourites again and obviously this month is January already. I can't believe like January is like almost over. And the reason why I'm doing this, like usually I do it like a little bit later. But we are going to be in America for the end of January. So like obviously I can't bring all my stuff with me to show. So that's why I wanted to film it before we leave to go to America. But anyways, I'm really super excited about filming this video. So without further ado, let's get on to the video. So I actually have like a lot of new products and what most of the new things I have are like clothes and I really just like wanted to show you like all of my new clothes but I'm just gonna show you like a few things that I've got recently these are like most of these clothes are like clothes that I'm gonna be wearing in America but like they're just so absolutely amazing I have to show them to you guys I'm actually just like I just realized there's one more oh, ah, right I've got my first favorite I realized that it wasn't in my pile anyways the first thing that I've got is something that my dad actually bought for me in a challenge and it was dad by daughter's outfits challenge so he bought three outfits for me and three outfits for my sister as well and when i first tried these on i wasn't like too sure about them but like i have actually fallen in love with them and literally i haven't worn leggings in like years mirrorcorns so like i wasn't really sure what this was gonna be like but anyways what i got are these really nice black leggings and these are from the new look 915 generation so yeah these are black leggings and they're really nice like feeling they've got this like really nice like sort of soft sort of silky feeling do you know what i mean mirrorcorns and on one leg it says California which is like obviously really fitting because I'm going to be going to America so lots of my clothes actually do say like places in America and things like that like California Brooklyn places like that but yeah these are really nice and I just absolutely love these because I think what it is is that like usually what I just wear are jeans and then I do have like one pair of jogging bottoms but like I mostly wear them like before I'm going to bed and like not out and about because I feel like they just look a bit like loose and they're just like not that nice do you know what I mean but these are like super comfy but they still feel like really nice and i'm definitely going to be wearing these on the plane journey there with a really nice top um which actually isn't in my favorites pile but yeah <laughs> so yeah i absolutely love these these are so soft and like i absolutely love them the next thing that i have is from river island like i'm gonna go through some clothes first and then i'll go through some other products mirrorcorns so this is from river island and it says mercy on it 1991 and it's sort of like loose and oversized which i really like like as you can tell the top i'm wearing right now this is like my absolute all-time favorite top but yeah anyways as you can tell like i really love like oversized sort of things especially if they're like cropped as well i just really like that sort of oversized like t-shirt when it's been cropped i really like that but yeah this is really nice and it has a little jaguar on it in gold which i thought is absolutely gorgeous the next thing that i have is oh my gosh i'd say this is like my favorite item out of all the clothes this once again is from the new look 915 generation actually like most of my clothes are from new look 915 generation but it's such a pretty like black off the shoulder like i think you call this like a cold shoulder top because it has like the straps here and then it has these bits that go here and then it shows off your shoulders and stuff but this is so pretty it's black and it has like this really nice sort of like i'm not sure what pattern this is but i just absolutely love this miracles like literally this is just like oh my gosh i just absolutely love this and this was actually on sale and i got this for six pounds when it was originally wow 15 pounds the next thing i have are some jeans and these are so so gorgeous and these are from the new look 915 generation or once again of course and these were these were 23 pounds and these are really gorgeous sort of rocked jeans and they have like little rips in them and then down the bottom they have like little rips in them which i quite like like the crop looks because usually what i do like for example the jeans i'm wearing right now I have to roll them up not because like they're too short but i just prefer like the look of where they're like rolled up no! Oh my gosh, it's a Ugh. Anyway, sorry about that little destruction mere corns. My pillow has decided to fall off all my bed. But yeah, anyways, these are a really gorgeous colour as well. I think that's what I really like about them. Like, I actually bought another pair of jeans. Like, uh, they're pretty 
pretty much identical to this, but they're like just a bit darker denim. But these are just so gorgeous. Like these are my absolute favorite. They're a really beautiful color. They're like sort of dark jeans, but then they're sort of lightish as well. Like I don't really like the light, 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 light denim color where it's like almost yellowish. I don't really like that that much. I, do, I don't really know why. I'm just not too keen on that color. But this is like, I can't describe how much I love this. Like this is absolutely merciful. That's all my clothes. Like I do have even more clothes that I would show you, but like like literally there are so many clothes that I just want to like talk about all of them all day long. The next thing I've been loving this month is a really oh my gosh these are so amazing these face masks by Superdrug. Now I haven't actually tried this particular one. This is tropical cocktail peel off mask. So this is mango fruit and noni fruit juice which I just I mean look at this absolutely gorgeous. This was only 99p but the other day I used this black lava one and these are by these are Superdrug own brand face mask and it was so good it made my skin feel so nice like I absolutely loved it like my friend actually bought that for me for Christmas and then like I loved it so much that like I've been going to the shops and buying them like all the time now so yeah I definitely recommend these to you the next thing I have is also once again super drug owned brand like I love super drug owned brand stuff like it's actually really good and like it's really cheap and affordable as well but this is a actually this is like a body spray and this is in the scent pink flowers and vanilla toffee I love anything that's like peanut butter toffee or like caramel flavored or scents like I don't know why well I mean not really peanut butter you don't really get peanut butter scent but <laughs> if you could I would probably absolutely love it but yeah this just smells so nice like literally smells so amazing it smells like vanilla and like it has a bit of floral to it as well because of like the pink flowers like just it smells so good meacorns i absolutely love this they have so many scents as well and then um there's like a deal where you can get like two for two pounds the next thing that i've got are some makeup brushes and i've been talking about getting some new makeup brushes for a while and this is actually a brush set that I bought by Real Technique but like these brushes are really good so I don't actually use them like for their purpose but this one is supposed to be used for like targeted blending brush and I actually like to use this for my concealer like it does come with a beauty blender but I don't like recently I've stopped like trying to like stop and use beauty blenders because I find even though I wash my beauty blenders like really really regularly like every one or two days i feel like it just like it really harbors like a lot of bacteria and because i have like acne prone skin i have to be really careful with like things that i use on my face so when i bought this i was really really happy about it because i feel like with a brush it's just like easier to wash and easier to get into all the little bristles when i first started makeup i did use a brush for my concealer but i found it like it made my makeup really really streaky because i don't think i was using like a proper brush i think i was using like like a blusher brush or something which was really silly of me but yeah anyways this works really well because the bristles are like really small and they're like really quite not necessarily stiff but they're like really close together a lot of them so i find it doesn't like it doesn't leave me like with any streaky marks if you go around in like circles like that then i find it leaves like no streak marks at all so i really like this the next brush is this strobing fan brush and this i like to use for my highlighter which i think is like it's intended purpose so this works really well then the last one this is called a multitask cheek brush so you can use this for blusher or you can use this for bronzer i actually already have a really good blusher brush so i like to use this for my bronzer and this is really really good and i just find it's like good if you get it on like on its side good to go all over your forehead and the sides of your face so yeah i really like these and i definitely recommend them to you these are really really good my last favorite this month is something that you guys have been recommending to me so much and this is actually like quite a recent buy like i only bought it like not that long ago but like i just wanted to show you it because it's been working so well for me and this is the collection lasting perfection ultimate wear concealer and this is really really good because basically this is like before i was using the bare minerals concealer and that was really good but it was like 20 pounds however this one is only like four or five pounds which is like an absolutely amazing difference but they work like really really similarly so i find like
like this one's like no better but it's not any worse than the Bare Minerals Concealer. In actual fact, I like, I mean it depends on your skin type, but I found with the Bare Minerals Concealer it was really good but it didn't really like mattify much. I like, but this one like quite, it feels quite matte because I have like quite oily skin. I find if I use like a lot of makeup that's like quite oily or that sort of like feeling, later on in the day it will be like touch my face and it'll be like really really oily. However, I find with this one it doesn't do that as much because basically it's like it just feels more matte and I'm using the shade Fair One. This is a really good concealer and I really enjoy using this. This is like my favourite thing in the whole entire world now. Like literally I never thought I'd find a concealer better than the Bare Minerals concealer but like I think I found something way way better. Mostly just because of the price wise. So anyway guys that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you haven't already make sure to click subscribe to become a Mia Corn. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys! Love you!